Sor College facilitator and all friends of ours Moya Catherine Anderson introduced us to Sol College. All our support groups are now using Sol College in the Ufafa Valley community. Even the Seca's kids do it to overcome their problems as they are vulnerable. It's a process, a transformational process brought to us by a trained facilitator who gave um, a few of us some training, Catherine Anderson. Um, she taught us the system of soul collage training where we make cards using this psychotherapy approach, it's a therapy predominantly, and we've adapted it to fit into the community, into the Zulu-speaking community, who've never experienced anything like Soul Collage before. So we've had to translate the questions and adapt the process into a Zulu context, into an African context, where it still has the effect of um, its original purpose, which is to bring up the aspects of the self, the subconscious, both positive and the shadow aspect. We use it for our team, our community care workers, our local team who are spread throughout the um, village. They come together once a month and to get quality time together we do the soul collage process translated into Zulu um, we don't go into the deeper aspects of creating different suits and so on we keep it just purely safe enjoyable and a time for us to relax and release deeper aspects of our souls because the care workers are dealing with um, issues of AIDS and homelessness and illness and all the difficult aspects of human life and dealing a lot with orphan-headed households. So this process of soul collage helps them to relax and release all these negativities and to nourish themselves from a deeper level. We also use it with our outreach groups, um, with the grannies who are um, looking after orphans, we use it for children living with AIDS, uh, um, outreach groups there. So it's an ongoing process, although we don't do it regularly, we do it at least once a month. So in a nutshell, that's, that's the African or the Zulu adaptation of Soul Collage that we at Ozumoya felt was a very necessary tool to assist in the stresses of working in our difficult situation. Uh, it was so interesting to me because um, I I just uh, noticed that uh, there are something that you can do and that can say something to you. It will help me because as I'm working with the community in the support groups, uh, it will help me because sometimes other people, the, it's difficult to express their feelings. The highlights are about the Soul Collage. It's that uh, it helps a lot because um, as people uh, you are asking a person not direct, indirect, but uh, the person can tell you many things. Uh, the way I will make it uh, special, I will do in the support groups as uh, how I, I did mention and uh, I'll, I'll make it in Zulu on, on their mother's tongue language. I can say I experienced a lot doing Soul Courage because before we didn't do uh, something like Soul Courage. So I experienced many things by doing it. I learned to do this. <coughs> uh, sometimes as we are uh, uh, people, uh, you need to sit down and look at yourself, Uti, who you are, uh, and look Uti, what are other things that make make you to be who you are. So, it's all collage, uh, make me feel good, and uh, I must look at myself as a whole, Uti, who, I, who, who am I and where do I come from. In my workplace, I think it's all collage will help me a lot because uh, at work, sometimes there are things that are coming, hurting your heart or 
uh, some other things that are coming um, unexpectedly. So at the workspace, it is it's all college uh, just teach me, which sometimes I need to sit down and calm and just listen to my feelings. Nizdik, <laughs> My mm-hmm. <laughs> As my first year I'm doing uh, ESOL College, I would like to say uh, it's a good experience or it's a, a good uh, opportunity to find this uh, chance to know about different uh, customs in which people use to deal with emotional issues and able to use it to relieve themselves. This is Tom